Hey Sparkers, what's up? Today I am going to go over at a very high level overview of the Spark AMP models that are included. Uh, there are 30 different AMP models uh, and they are organized and categorized um, into to, uh, clean AMPs, glassy AMPs, crunch AMPs, high gain metal, acoustic, and bass. So I'm going to go through that list with you real quick on all 30 of these guys and talk a little bit about what they're inspired by, uh, the, um, the original classic amps that they're, they were after when they were trying to emulate these sounds. And so uh, a lot of these amps are uh, based on those classic amps. Not, not all of them, uh, but most of them are. So I'm going to quickly go over that list with you and show you how they're, they're organized. So first up is we go to the amps here. We double tap that. And number one is uh, this starts off in the clean category. So there's the silver 120. Uh, this is number one, and it's inspired by the Roland JC120. Number two is the Black Duo, and this is inspired by the Fender Twin Reverb. Um, the third uh, clean amp is the AD30, and this is inspired by the Orange AD30 amp. And then the final clean amp is the Match DC, number four, and this is based on the Matchless DC30 amp. Then we get into the Glassy uh, tone amps. There's four more of these guys. Number five is the Tweed Bass, and this is be, uh, based on the Fender Bassman. And number f uh, six is the AC Boost amp. Uh, this is uh, inspired by the Vox AC30. Uh, then you have number seven, which is the Checkmate, and this is inspired by the Tysco Checkmate 20 amp. And then finally in the glassy category, we have the Two Stone SP50, and this is inspired by the Two Rock Studio Pro 50. Uh, next up, uh, the next category is the Crunch Amps, and there's uh, four more of these. So we have the first up, number nine, is the American Deluxe, and this is inspired by the 57 uh, Fender Custom Deluxe Amp. Uh, next up is the Plexiglass at number 10, and this is uh, originally inspired by the Marshall Super Lead 100 Amp. And then the next up after that, number 11, is the JM45. This is inspired originally by the Marshall JTM 45 amp. And then finally in the crunch category, we have the Lux Verb at number 12, which is inspired by the Fender Deluxe Reverb amp. Uh, then we have, go into the high gain category of amps, and there's actually five of these. The first one is number 13, the RB101, and this is based on the Bogner Ecstasy 101. Uh, then you have number 14, which is the British 30, and this is inspired by the Orange AD30 amp. Uh, then we have Number 15 is the American High Gain, which is inspired by the Mesa Boogie JP2C amp. Then you have the Slow 100, number, number 16, based on the Soldano Slow 100. Then the last High Gain amp is the YJM 100 at number 17, and this is inspired by the Marshall YJM 100 signature amp. Uh, next up, we have uh, the metal category of amps, so there's five more of these. Uh, so you'll notice there was five high gain and five metal. All the other categories have four. Uh, but the first is the number 18, which is the tread plate. And this is inspired by the Mesa Bogey Triple Rectifier amp. And then we have the 5153 at number 19. This is inspired by the EVH 5153 uh, amp. And then you have the Switch Axe at number 20, which is inspired by the H&K Switchblade amp. Uh, then you have the Rocker V at number 21. This is inspired by the Orange Rock Verb 50 amp. And then finally in the metal category, we have the BE-101, and this is inspired uh, by the Friedman BE-100 amp. Uh, the next category of amps is the acoustic amps, and actually three of, of these four amps in the acoustic category are actually uh, positive grid original uh, amps. They're not necessarily... Um, emulating any any particular original amp. So this first one is in that category, the Pure, pure Acoustic. This is a positive grid original. Uh, then you have the Fishboy at number 24, and this is actually inspired by the Fishman Acoustic Amp. And then the last two acoustic amps are the number 25 Jumbo, uh, which is a positive grid original, and the Flat Acoustic, uh, also a positive grid original. Uh, you can sort of get a hint uh, from the names as to how those are supposed to sound. And then finally, we have the four uh, bass amplifiers um, models. Uh, number 27 is the RB800. This is the Gallon Kruger 800RB bass amp. Then you have the Sunny 3000 at number 28. This is the Sun 300T amp. 
Then at number 29 is the W600, and this is inspired by the Eating WTP600. And finally, you have the Hammer 500, and this is inspired by the Aguilar Tone Hammer 500 amp. So again, this was the, just a high-level overview of uh, all 30 of the different amps, what they're inspired by, if they are, um, and uh, most of which are. And so I wanted to give everyone a little uh, tip on how to, how to see how that works. So hopefully this helps you out, and uh, good luck. Thanks.